Hello, welcome to Cooking with Chef Brett. We're getting ready to start a series on uh, knife skills. We're going to start with onion. Uh, if you want to see carrot and celery coming out in the next couple of weeks, go ahead and hit subscribe. We're going to roll into a chicken stock after that and then put all the videos together so you can make a chicken soup. I'm going to take you down to the cutting board now. We'll see. All right, so step one. I've got a wet paper towel underneath the board here to keep it from sliding around. So when you approach the board, you want to be kind of straight on. The board is set so it's not sliding around. And we're going to take our thumb and our index finger, and we're going to pinch the knife like that and then wrap these three fingers around. This is going to give us a lot more control holding the knife. You're going to cut both ends of the onion. Uh, the root end, I'm not going to go as deep. I want to leave, leave a little of that. That's going to hold it in place. Cut the onion in half. Now I have a flat surface where the onion meets the cutting board. That gives us a more stable cutting. I'm going to peel off the skins here. This is a pretty good looking onion. Sometimes this next layer of skin can be a little thick. Um, sometimes I'll peel that off, depending on what I'm making. Like if you're making some tacos or something where salsa where you weren't gonna cook the onion, you might wanna get off that thicker layer. Now there's two ways to go about this. In culinary school, I was taught to cut in like this. And then you cut down like that. Now, I feel like the onion that kind of already has the layers there. So if you're looking for a little more precision, go ahead and make that cut, those two cuts there. And then we just slice down the onion like this. And I'm being careful not to go all the way through so this kind of still holds itself together. If we wanted a thicker onion, we could do wider cuts, smaller pieces, you know, thinner cuts in between. And then with your hand, you kind of make like a claw with the tips curled in so you don't catch them. And then the knife kind of glides down off the knuckle. And we do our slices. Now if you get down there, just give that a little chop, a turn and chop. I have these two little layer things that fell off the side. I could come back and give them a little chop. If we needed precision, maybe you could just save those for stock or something. So on this half, I'm gonna show you like I was doing. I'm not making these two cuts. I'm just doing these cuts across here like this. I don't feel like there's a big difference between the two. You know, I got down here and I feel like it's falling apart and I don't really feel like I got good control. So I just put it down on the flat side. Give it a turn. I'll just chop this part up. Now you may watch a lot of other videos on how to dice an onion. I don't think you've seen anybody that's going to do that at the end like I just did. But again, we're not going for super precision here. This is the basics on how to dice an onion. You can refine as you go along. All right, thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one. We're gonna be dicing and selling.